How's it going, Troublemakers? Welcome to another Movie Commentary Monday. I was thinking maybe I should get away from Disney for a minute. But then I thought, why? 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 I'm quite thoroughly enjoying going to the Disney movies, so why should I leave? Don't make me leave. You guys obviously enjoy the videos as well. At some point, I'm gonna run out of Disney movies to do. But to be honest, we haven't even scratched some of the classics. I'm talking Shrek. I'm talking Toy Story. Wait, Sh is Shrek Disney? No, <laughs> Shrek is DreamWorks. Okay, my bad. <laughs> you get my point, though. I'm gonna go through some of these classic films, and Lilo and Stitch is amongst them. I'm gonna be honest. When I was a kid and I watched this, I remember loving this so much. I know this movie, guys. I know that Stitch is an alien, and it's Hawaii. Everything else I forgot, but that's just great for me. I can't tell you how excited I am for this. I remember loving this movie so much. Oh, Stitch is on trial. Yeah, maybe? Accused of illegal genetic experimentation. <laughs> Not guilty. That would be irresponsible. I would never, ever make more than one. <laughs> oh, Stitch is a lab animal? I call it Experiment 626. What a catchy name. <laughs> I call it... Experiment number 135. His only instinct to destroy everything he touches! <laughs> yeah, he's a mad scientist. I'm pretty sure he becomes a good person, a good character, or someone we cheer for, but he's crazy. He literally created a war device, a war machine. One that probably could be mass produced in time if he perfected one. This man needs to be locked up. On the other hand, though, I do cheer for war and death in a lot of these movies, so let them free. It must be destroyed! Experiment 626. Give us some sign you understand any of this. <laughs> Just moons them, pulls his pants down, rubs his butt cheeks against the glass. <laughs> Did that robot just throw up nuts and bolts? I prefer to be called Evil Genius! Evil G yeah, he recognizes himself as evil. It is the flawed product of a deranged mind. It has no place among us. True. These are all facts. God, if I watched this as an adult and didn't have like an infinity for it, I'd be like cheering. I would be cheering for him to be destroyed. Straight up. Oh. <laughs> What? What is happening? Either they are using his blood to power weapons, which is a strange way to power weapons, <laughs> or the blood was telling the weapons to like lock on to the blood signature of the person who has that blood, which is actually a really cool touch. The council has banished you. To <laughs> He's so tall. That's a tall ass shark. These guns are locked onto your genetic signature. Yeah, see? Okay, good. Oh, what's that sound? Does he got a cushy ass seat? Listen to it deflate. <laughs> That's the sound if you sit on a cushion with a lot of air in it. Either that was like a really airy fart. <laughs> There's no genetic signature in saliva, is there? I'm no botanist, but I don't think that's how saliva works. Security, convert. Oh, he's super strong too. It's in the ventilation system. Yeah, shoot your ventilation system. That seems like Red. Yeah, you're an idiot. You just keep shooting holes in your ship. Is there any use for having a horn in your spaceship? You can't hear it. There's no sound in space. It's like, beam, beam, watch out, other, other space cars. <laughs> I'm coming through. He won't survive in water. His molecular density is too great. Oh, that looks like a Hawaii. Hawaii. How much time do we have? This is contained to one island. Imagine if he landed in, like, Asia. He could go anywhere. Hold everything. Mike Wazowski, what are you doing here? And when did you go through your growth spurt? Can we not simply destroy the island? No! Crazy head? <laughs> Crazy head! <laughs> are they intelligent? No. These are extremely simple creatures, miss. I love how they're just crapping on human beings. Like, they're not that intelligent. Yet, their trial is not unique at all. It's very similar to our own, the way that we impose justice. They speak the same way that we do. Their, their, their society's set up the same way that our society's set up. 
So don't crap on me, movie. I'm doing just fine as a human. We all are, okay? You can stick to your space honking horns. How does that make sense? You're stupid. I just became extremely protective over my species for some reason. I, who's attacking it? No one. Idiot scientist Jim. How did he get a newspaper in his cell? He's eating paper. I'm sure this comes as no surprise to you. Nature for Did they really just send like the empress of this world into the prison cell of a convicted felon? Alone. She's with little tall ass Mike Wazowski. You must now bring him back. What me? We are willing to trade your freedom for his capture. What? Are you joking? Why would you, you just convicted him. Why would you let him free? He showed no remorse. Who's gonna control him? You will. Ooh. <laughs> I'm so caught up in like all the damage this little war creature can do that I totally forgot this is like a kid's movie and he's gonna be friends with the little girl. I'm out here like, God damn, Earth is screwed. It's gonna get destroyed. But this isn't Independence Day. This is Lilo and Stitch. Oh, God damn. That's me. That's me. That's fat me. Dude, I don't, I don't get tan. I get red. And then the tan burns off and I'm just white again. Like, paper white. I don't have to explain myself. You see it. Did he really have to count the kids? <laughs> He's like, it doesn't seem like the right amount of kids. One, two, three, four. That's not five. Let me count again, just in case. One, two, three. Wait, where was I again? Let's start over. One, two, three, four. Yes, four is not five. Why are you all wet? Every Thursday I take Pudge the Fish a peanut butter sandwich. Shh. And today we are out of peanut butter. So I asked my sister what to give him and she said a tuna sandwich. I can't give Pudge tuna. That's cannibalism. Do you know what tuna is? Dad, look at this girl. I'm cheering for her. Environmentally conscious. You don't feed a cow a cow. You don't feed a fish a fish. I don't think fish enjoy peanut butter though. Like you, you a little stupid kid for that part. But like I'm, a, I'm, I'm impressed. It's fish. <laughs> Why is this so important? Pudge controls the weather. You're crazy. <laughs> oh my God! She's beating a hoe up. Yo, she crazy, crazy. One little slight insult and she was throwing fists. No, 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 no not these kind of fists. Straight down fists. These are crazy people fists. If you ever see someone get on top of someone else and come down with these strikes instead of these strikes, you know they're insane. Pa, pa, crazy person. No, I'll be good. You just crazy person punched. Ew, she bit me. Girl, yeah, she crazy. Are you gonna play dolls? You don't have a doll. <gasps> I made her, so I pretend to bug laid eggs in her ears. And she's upset because she only has a few more- Damn, they scram quick. Hey! <laughs> Stupid head! What are you talking about? You jumped in front of that car. And then you kicked it. Lilo, we don't- Did she nail- Oh my god. Don't tell me she nailed the door shut. Leave me alone to die. <laughs> Lilo, the social worker's gonna be here any minute. Social worker? Oh boy, that's the car that she kicked, isn't it? Oh, I'm gonna stuff you in the blender, push puree, then bake you into a pie and feed it to the social worker. And when he says, hmm, this is great, what's your secret? I'm gonna say, love. She's talking about going full Arya Stark. She's talking about baking her sister into a pie to feed to the social worker. <laughs> this whole family's crazy. You must be the stupid head. Oh. That's the least worst part of what you said. Nice to meet you, Mr. Bubbles. Mr. Bubbles. Uh, wait here. She just busted a window. Do you often leave your sister home alone? No, never. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, that kitchen's a mess. It's coming along great. <laughs> oh my God. Disgusting kitchens are the worst. 
Did you ever kill anyone? We're getting off the subject. Well, that's sketch. She didn't answer. She disciplines me real good. Sometimes five times a day. With bricks. Bricks. In a pillowcase. Okay, that's enough. Uh, 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 uh. Bricks in a pillowcase. <laughs> I didn't remember this part. <laughs> Voodoo. I didn't remember that there was a like a social worker type of thing. My friends need to be punished. Oh, the social the social worker, if he hears the girl screaming just after he leaves, he's coming back in or calling the cops. Oh, get the bricks! Get the bricks! <laughs> no! Mm. <laughs> Ah, you know, is Lilo not the best Disney character? I mean, it's perfect too, because it makes me not want to have a kid. You know, like all these Disney movies, I see the kids, they're so well behaved and perfect and kind. And I'm like, I want one. And then I see this and I'm like, never mind. Aren't we? What do you say, no. sad kid? We're a broken family, aren't we? Oh, well, damn, you're just going to call it out like that, huh? No. No. We're not broken, just you. You're broken. I hit Myrtle Edmonds today before I bit her. <laughs> I promise not to yell at you, except on special occasions. Tuesdays and bank holidays would be good. Bank holidays? God! Can we talk about how good this is? Uh oh. Damn, it's been 23 minutes already. It's literally only an hour left of this movie. And Lila and Stitch haven't even met. Gravity is increasing on me. No, it's not. <laughs> you rotten sister, your body is crushing me. <laughs> I need someone to be my friend. Someone who won't run away. Maybe send me an angel. The nicest angel you have. Send me the nicest angel you have, and this is a little demon boy. Oh, don't blow this frog apart. <laughs> Is that how Lilo and Stitch come together? Do they adapt? Oh, they do. Are there any animals in here? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, he's formulating. Oh, what? Where did those arms go? Where did those... How? How? Uh, uh, what is that thing? A dog, I think. But it was dead this morning. I thought it was dead. It was hit by a truck. Why did you put it in a cage then? You literally... It, it woke up in a cage. You put what you thought was a dead dog in a cage with three other dogs? What the f- Yo, can we get that social worker to come to this place? Cause this place is the messed up place. I think they were trying to feed the dogs with a dead dog. Being like, hey, if you're hungry enough, you'll start feasting on this dead dog. Messed up. His name is Stitch. No, that's not a real name oh. in Iceland, but here it's a good name. <laughs> Stitch isn't that far out of a name. Stick around town and stay out of the roads, okay? With no leash. Brand new dog. Not even with a leash. My friend! Ah! <laughs> oh god, flashbacks to my childhood. Hey, friends! Ah, here he comes, quick! Hey, over here, little buddy. Were you really telling a dog, or what you thought was a dog, to pass the ball? <laughs> Why do I feel like he becomes a love interest for the girl, the older sister? Obviously not for Lilo. That would be weird. What is this, Twilight? <laughs> you imprinted on my daughter? She's a baby! It's unusually high for someone your size. We have to fix that. Ew, 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 ew. You sure it's a dog? He used to be a collie before he got ran over. Oh, that's how they explain it away? It looks different because it got ran over? I was wondering, you're not doing anything this- David, I told you, I can't. I got a lot to deal with right now. She likes her butt and fancy hair. I read her diary. She thinks it's fancy? What about the butts? She likes her butt, homie. That's the bigger win. <laughs> she just straight up punched the dog. <laughs> Oh, that wig stayed on. Damn, where do you get your wigs from? This is not working out. Who wants to work at this stupid, fakey luau anyway? Damn, girl, now you don't got a Did job. Did you lose your job because of stitching me? Yes. Nah. Yes. No, I don't even think it's a dog. We just have to take him back. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> He's obviously mutated from something else. Yeah, genetic experimentation. Dad said Ohana means family. 
Oh, wait, this is gonna be something, isn't it? Ohana means family. Family means nobody, nobody gets, gets left, left behind. Oh my god, it's like the American school system. No child will be left behind. No child left behind. Be careful of that. You don't touch this. Don't ever touch it. Where was the picture of her family? Did her parents die? Do we get the backstory? <laughs> Oh, I thought she was gonna choke him with it. A mosquito has chosen me as her perch. Yikes. Yikes. Oh, worst nightmare. <laughs> what? Did you just pull roadmaps of Iowa? What is the giant body of water in Iowa? Can we look at a map of Iowa? Tell me if you see any giant bodies of water. Do you see any? Maybe if it's like a really big close up and there's like a, a lake, but there's no 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 i take my facts about iowa very seriously he's sad because he's all alone and nobody wants him but on this page his family hears him crying and they find him that's the whole story wait, wait, wait. <laughs> in this book i thought this book would be the ugly duckling but literally in two pages the story's over i'm lost next page found it with his family and happy where's the story progression <laughs> he went from zero to a hundred so fast. Oh no, I'm lost. Okay, I'm loved again. Story over. The abbreviated version. <laughs> yeah, no, the book is the duck. Unless it's a book about different duck stories in which every like two pages, there's a brand new story about a duck. But this whole book, <laughs> what are the rest of the pages? Is it just empty? Or are those just two thick pages? Oh, is it the social work? Oh no. <gasps> Heard you lost your job. I... Just not conducive to uh, the challenges of raising a child. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he just threw the book in his face. <laughs> That's so funny. And next time I see this dog, I expect it to be a model citizen. Dogs aren't citizens, though. They're animal. They're, they're pets. Elvis Presley was a model citizen. I've compiled a list of his traits for you to practice. Whoa, 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 Elvis, wasn't he, like, addicted to cocaine? Uh, abuse, prescription drugs, a lot of infidelity. <laughs> so this is the title of an article. What about the model citizen thing again? <laughs> oh, view ga I don't want to see a gallery of this. Yes, I do. He shot a, a gun with his girlfriend nearby into the bathroom. Mr. By Just Inches, cool. He stole drugs from a dentist. This is the wildest one. While under the influence of drugs, an unsteady Presley once showed off his samurai sword moves on a motionless Thompson who feared for her life. Can you imagine a drugged up Elvis Presley just being like, yo, check out my katana. Sa, sa, sa. <laughs> sa. <laughs> I'm wondering what um, the sister does. Uh, there's a social worker right back there. I wonder what the sister ends up getting. Cause she's gotta get some sort of like positive thing in her life. You know, she's gotta come into a good job or some money or something. It's a Disney movie, it's gotta end well. <laughs> what? There's no amp. How does that make that much noise? Oh, there's the amp. Oh boy. It's not plugged into the amp though, so they just have wireless guitars, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> he just launched that kid. Oh man, this ice cream. Oh boy. Ah, oh, the sad music starting. Oh no. Why would he agree to go out on water? He hates water. In fact, I think it would literally kill him. I could be wrong about that though. I don't know that it kills him, but I just know he's very resistant to it. adorable is that uh, do you think animals know when they're being adorable like when a dog comes up to you and it's like mm. do you think it knows they expected you back by now with 626 in hand again their technology is so awful it's just like a little screen come on we have better technology than that they're supposed to be so far advanced mm, no what happened oh my god Oh, what? No! Did you just kick Stitch? Girl, you just kicked the dog. <laughs> oh, I just kicked the... I just throat kicked that dog. And it kind of seemed friendly. It was like, bro, why'd you fucking kick me in the throat? Are they gonna give CPR on this thing? There's no way. There's no way they're giving CPR on this supposed dog. <laughs> But you need to think about what's best. Uh, how, how? Oh my god. I feel so... I feel like I betrayed your trust. How have I not... 
Turn this light on. I'm so sorry. We a uh, solid blue. I got good solid blue. Give me a deeper blue. I feel so bad. It's been off the whole time. Oh my god. I'm so. Can you forgive me? <laughs> That's better. I'll be back tomorrow morning for Lilo. Yikes. Damn, she's getting Lilo taken away from her for reals. Is there something I can do? Yeah, you can shut the fuck up. I don't need your support right now, bro. I need my sister. I really believed they had a chance. Then you came along. Poor little Stitch. Oh, with the ears back. Oh, it's the lonely duck. Or the ugly duckling. Oh. We have two, huh? Don't worry, you're nice. And someone will give you a job. I would. Come here. God, this is so nuanced. It's so dark. Mm. How'd they die? That's us before. The plague? It was rainy, and they went for a drive. Family means nobody gets left behind. But if you want to leave, you can. I'll remember you, though. What? I remember everyone. How does she know that? Wait, 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 wait. I remember everyone that leaves. He's like, chase after me, bitch. He's gonna let me go? Fine, I see how it is. Was he gonna turn himself over to the aliens? What's he gonna do? Turn to the one page, the one page story. Lost. Oh. Lost. Oh God, how is this movie so sad? Have you captured 626 or not? Why did they send two? Incompetence is nothing short of unspeakable. I was fired and prison bound. Consider yourselves fired in prison bound. You're gonna jail someone for failing at their job. That's your enlightened advanced society If you don't do your job, we're gonna put you in jail But also why would you send two people one a convicted felon? Why would you send two people when you know how important this job is like you're literally promising the freedom of the felon For completing this job. That's how important it is. Why not send a team? Send a team. How soon will you be prepared to leave? Immediately. Slept in the woods. On the one page <laughs> that we've seen in the book. <laughs> it's on the one page. <laughs> you can never belong. Now you should be in jail if you're gonna say mean stuff like that. Baby, what's wrong? Stitch left. Really? Wait, 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 she just accepts it? <laughs> Dogs don't just leave. If someone came, if, if you own a dog and someone in your family is like, the dog left, you'd be like, oh, did it run away? Can we go find it? Should we put up posters? You wouldn't be like, oh, okay, the dog left. Just like dad. <laughs> I think I found you a job. You what? Oh, man, this guy's coming in clutch. Things are finally turning around. You shouldn't even get the job yet. You can just date me and we'll call it even. <laughs> oh, he caught a laser shot. Uh-oh, it's gonna fall. It's gonna fall. <laughs> Called, I'm a professional movie watcher. I knew it. Running away? These two, these two people are like the prototype, Mike and Rand, uh, who is it? Mike, no, Randall was the villain. The Monsters Inc. crew. The big guy from Monsters Inc. is this guy, and then the Mike Wazowski character is the other one with one eye. Man, they really, <laughs> these were the prototypes. Let me stop you. Aliens are attacking my house. Oh good, my dog found the chainsaw. Lilo, don't hang. The sh my dog found the chainsaw. <laughs> You just know. Oh, don't turn left. You just know. <laughs> no. Is this what she needs? The house just exploded. Oh! You ruined everything. Oh, don't turn on him now. <laughs> How did this like eight ton creature sneak up on them? He shakes the ground when he walks. <laughs> Talk! I know you can. Okay, okay. Ah! <laughs> uh, sorry, we do not know anyone by this. Uh. Why is this English broken? You've been speaking English the entire time. So she's gone? Look at the bright side. You won't have to yell at anyone anymore. Oh, fuck. Now's not the time, homie. Now is not the time. Hey! What? After all you put me through, you expect me to help you just like that? <laughs> Fine. <laughs> He's very persuasive. Persuasive? <laughs> this movie is so funny. If there was a gap in the tube, enough for a stitch to get out of, there's once you're in space, there's gonna be no air. You're screwed. You're gonna kill 
Lilo. Ah, oh, he is mooning them. <laughs> That's what I thought he was going to do at the beginning of the movie. Wow, your accuracy is terrible. That is a big ship. Dude, you gotta... There you go. Oh, you're a bad driver, too. He's the worst. He's the worst pilot. Why wouldn't you send a pilot along with him if you know his, his limitations? In order to capture Stitch, they sent one guy. So they send two guys, it fails, so they're like, okay, we'll just send one guy this time. That'll probably work. <laughs> so stupid. Oh yeah, careful, your little sister is out there. She's on that ship. Don't leave me, okay? Okay. He's got super good hearing. Is he driving into a volcano? What the f- Look how big he is. He's almost the size of that entire ship. Nobody gets left behind. Oh, okay. Yeah, it hit me with that sweet wood. Did she just kiss her dog? I guess that's not super weird. But this is kind of the moment where like the damsel would kiss the hero. So like, it just kind of threw me off for a second. And I'm like, what kind of relationship do they have again? <laughs> Lilo and Stitch 2 is like them growing up being lovers. <laughs> My name Stitch. Oh yeah, to be in the movie. The Stitch have to go in the ship. They wanted signs that it was like intelligent, you know? Who are you? This is my family. I found it all on my own. Okay. It's little and broken. I can cry. Still nope. good. Yep. Yeah. Still good. Yes, yeah, okay. Okay. Mm -mm. Didn't you buy that thing at the shelter? Hey! She just keeps that on her? I paid two dollars for him. I own him. If you take him, you're stealing. Aliens are all about rules. How would you know that? Roswell, 1973. Oh. As caretaker of the alien life form stitch. What if Bubbles ends up dating the sister? He's like, oh, I gotta watch over this family. And then he ends up falling for the sister and they get married. <laughs> and then the other guy who is like wanting to date the sister is like, what the fuck? Oh, they're going to rebuild the house. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it prepares lunches. <laughs> uh, this town just accepts that there's a dog dancing up there with the humans. Uh, what? Okay. Look at that guy. Bubbles on the couch. Looks very comfortable with Lilo. He might be dating the sister. There he is at the family meal. Oh, okay, the other guy's there too. I was just saying, hey, where's the other guy? It's just Bubbles. He's the father now. Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. I gotta be honest, this might just be the best Disney movie ever. 86%? Bro, what are you smoking? Who? Who said anything bad about this? Peter Bradshaw, cheerful but below par. I find your review not cheerful and below par. This is a very disappointing effort from Disney, Felix Vasquez Jr. Yeah, well, I find you to be a very disappointing effort from your father. He gave you his name and you want to crap on this movie. Lilo has so much character. I laugh so much in this movie. It's fantastic. That's how I clap. Great job. Great work. I hope you guys enjoyed this movie commentary Monday. Until next time, toodles!